Hi, my name's Max Brown. I play Oliver Johnson and I'm from the UK. My name's Brittany Ashworth. I am from London and I play Kathleen. My name is Cristina Serafini. I play Anne and I'm from Italy, as you can hear from my beautiful accent. My name is Atanas Srebrev. I am from Bulgaria. I play Henry, good old Henry. My name is Nigel Barber and I'm playing the character Randall Johnson. I'm originally from Los Angeles, but for the last 10 years I've been working and living in the United Kingdom. My name is Kate Nichols, I play Joanne Burroughs, and I'm originally Bulgarian. Hi, I'm Ivan Donev, and I'm Leonardo, the big fashion designer, and I'm from Bulgaria. My character used to dream of becoming a fashion designer, but she couldn't make it, so basically she's passing all of her dreams to her daughter, Kathleen. Who is a fashion designer in New York. And then when we meet her right at the beginning of the movie, she gets a phone call out of the blue, telling her that she's inherited. Grandmother's horse ranch. And she comes with the caveat. She has to go and spend two weeks on the horse ranch before she inherits it. She can't just sell. So she goes and she meets the people that work there. She sort of starts to fall in love with the land. And of course, there's a boy. But then, well, I'm not going to tell you the whole story because you guys have to watch the movie, so... I think parts of Kathleen are quite like me because I'm quite dorky and quite clumsy. I'm very down-to-earth, very simple, and she's not the nicest, so I want to believe she's different. He's a big property developer, rather cutthroat, thinking about profit before heart. And uh, I think probably I'm the other way of that, but uh, I find it inside of me to pull out something to be honest about the character's portrayal. My character is like me because she's caring. You know, she's all about family and I'm like that. Pretty cool kind of cowboy character. So as much as I'd love to think that I could be that, I'm not. I'm actually a fashion designer, but <laughs> full time. But sometimes when they ask me, I'm actor. All that decoration, the mannequins, the haute couture designs are part of my life. So it was really easy and helping me to, to be Leonardo. I think I'd actually be the character of Toby, who's the little boy. Katie or Anne. I've always wanted to do a female lead, so that would be it. One of the chickens, because <laughs> they just play all day and they're, they are fed by everybody and nobody eats them, so that's very relaxing. <laughs> if it's a female character I'd have to play, it would be Kathleen. But if I could pick any character, I think it'd be Henry, because he's a pretty cool cowboy <laughs> kind of rancher, and I'd like to try that. Probably my favourite experience on set has been the day when we shot my scenes with Oliver where we go on our horse riding date. And all of a sudden, 40 horses, like wild horses from the ranch, came over one by one and they're like crossing over, jumping in. It was just the most magical thing. I called my mum afterwards. It's like, my work was pretty good today. <laughs> The first that comes to mind is you're not able to pet a horse every day on a set, so... Riding the horses, they've been incredible. Uh, there we go, right on cue. First day for me, walking on set and realising there are three or four people working on this, actors, DOP, a few of the other independents, the couple of sparks that I've worked before on a couple of other projects here in Bulgaria. And it was almost like coming home. The team feels more like a family than a professional environment. They've been absolutely amazing, this team. Um, I hadn't worked with anyone before. From Toshka's energy, the director, he's incredible. He's in, very inspiring and uh, gets the whole crew going. Everybody is very kind and brilliant. Toshka is fantastic. And yeah, fantastic time. Also, I think it being a rom-com really brings a lot of laughter. I think we've laughed every day on set, Max, as well. I think the film will appeal to a lot of people actually, it's uh, you know, a romantic comedy so it's got some very comedic moments in there and uh, some really touching sweet romantic moments also, so I think uh, anything from a teenage girl upwards will enjoy it. Good people, I mean people are going to think that you're horrible if you don't like this movie. I'd say anyone with a pulse. It's just a beautiful love story, you know, and it's all about finding where you belong, so I think that's true to anybody. 
we don't need more disaster films. I don't think we need more catastrophe than we already have in our day-to-day -day life. And I think these kind of films, which are about self and empowerment and following your heart, I think is really important for what's going on right now in our society.